Hi. Um, I am still talking through the different scenarios in the preliminary Danish mission pack. This one is Cleanse, which is from the Jugger pack. It's a variation of the Sectus scenario from the rulebook. Um, you divide the table up into the regular sectors, the, like the four quarters, right? And then you roll off, and the one who wins the roll gets to pick the quarter they want. Um, all that, that's pretty standard. Like in sectors, you can't deploy within 12 inches of the, uh, the central point, um, like the center of the board, and that's pretty much it. But you have four objectives in uh, cleanse. You have one in your own sector, you have one in the opponent sector, and you have one in each of the neutral sectors, and they are placed in the center of each sector. Um, and you get different points for them. Your own is worth one point if you control it at the end. So not a lot, especially since you also have kill points in this mission, one point per dice that the enemy's lost. So not so much. The neutral uh, objectives are five points each better, but if you can get the enemy's objective, it's 10 points. So, how do you win this? Uh, you can't outflank, outflank in this, you can't forward deploy, you can have reserves, which will uh, come on uh, from your whole table length, and the rest is deployed by Dyson Bag. There's no reason not to deploy stuff, um, Dyson Bag, in your own sector, because there's, there's no um, preliminary bombardment, nothing is dangerous. So just have your killer units start on the table. That's my first advice. Have whatever you need um, to have in to kill the enemy. Uh, especially if you have artillery. I think your artillery should be placed so that it can see your own objective and the at least one or two of the neutral objectives. So that you can sort of dominate those areas uh, while defending your own objective. That will be a benefit. Um, should you push for the enemy's objective? Well, you're going to have to win somehow. Because what, what will most often happen is that you'll take your own, uh, you'll defend your own uh, objective, and you'll take the one in the uh, objective in your side of the board in the neutral zone. The enemy do the same, and then you're at a draw. Right, um, but if you have something that's fast and mobile and survivable, then wait for the last turn and fling it up, contest the enemy's objectives. That is a way that you can win. Another way that you can win is by being ahead on kill points. Um, so make sure that the enemy is not ahead on kill points because that will mean that you're going to have to push to getting his objectives. I don't think it's worth it. For most armies, it's not worth it trying to get the enemy's objective. Um, pushing that far up into the enemy's zone will mean that for most armies, you're gonna lose troops. You're gonna lose units, and that will mean that the enemy gets ahead, which is bad. So mostly this is a tactical game where if you can get that uh, enemy objective, yes, go for it, but most of the time you will not be able to do that, especially because you're going to have to divide your force between one, two, maybe even three points, right? Your own, you're going to have to defend that, otherwise it's ten points for the enemy. And you're going to have to take the neutral one, and you're going to have to try and push for the enemy's back line or something, right? So uh, a tactical one where there's a lot of thought process and you have to divide your force, um, which makes it interesting again. Can you do this without dividing your force? Yes, you may be able to do that. You may be able to ignore the one in your neutral zone or just take it with one like lieutenant or a small team or something, just pushing up to that and then push towards the enemy but that demands a certain type of list that can push. Um, and not all armies can do that well. So my suggestion is at least start out by having your own, by taking the one in a neutral zone, and then think about how to go up and contest one of the opponent's objectives. That should give you the win. Right, that was cleanse. Cheers.